So, you want to get taller, whatever the reason, to make the basketball team to get the respect of your friends or to just attract more girls. Being taller is the most physically desired trait amongst young men. And there's actually a primitive reason behind this. To stand at a physically higher plane than your peers gives you a sense of confidence and an edge over them. And if you, if this is something that you don't want, that's fine. But I remember for the longest time, I always, I always wanted to be taller. And I know that for the people around me, that's something they want as well. Just over a year ago, I was 5'6", but now I'm 5'11 and a half. And although you might call this self interested and quite shallow i think that if this is something you want there's a simple way to do it so what worked for me something that everyone says to you when talking about height is it's just genetics there's no point trying and the truth is it's true 70 percent is genetics but the 30 percent it is something that we can control so we should start focusing on that 30 percent to maximize our growth so firstly the beliefs before trying any of this, you have to have the right beliefs. So your parents are short, so you're destined to be short. No, my parents are literally like five, six and five, eight, which is quite short, but I'm still five, 11 and a half. And I've seen so many outliers. Ask all your tall friends. Of course, like probably like some of them might, might have tall parents, but it's not the only reason. Also, you have to drop this belief that, oh, I'll just wait until puberty. And if it happens, that's good. But if not, oh, well. That's the mistake that so many people make. They wait for puberty, but then it's too late. Puberty ends and they're still short and they regret not doing the right things during this golden age between 13 and 18, which is really when you can drastically improve your height. So the first actionable tip is to cut out fast food and bulk. So cutting out fast food is quite self-explanatory, but the food, this type of like processed food is really detrimental to your height and it could directly stunt your growth and you could do some research on this but the bro science version is just cut it out completely and replace it with filling high protein high carb foods and eat a lot a, a lot of this because think about it like you're literally this is the time when you're growing the most so you need to fuel your body and give yourself the calories and protein that you need and i know that for me especially like i always used to be scared because i wanted to be this like lean tiktok boy look but the thing is, you if you can have a jawline and abs by being stick, stick thin, but is that really what you want? We want to be tall and quite big, but at the same time, we could cut down later. But as I said, this 13 to 18, around this time, is your golden age for you to start growing. And you could always lose fat and cut later, but you can't really grow outside of this age. So drop all your fears that you have about becoming fat, because if you cut out processed foods, which is the thing that's making you fat in the first place and you eat healthy and filling foods i promise you that not only will you not get fat but you'll increase you'll see an increase in height and the second one is weightlifting and this one's controversial because everyone says like oh weightlifting is going to stunt your growth you shouldn't weightlift because i remember like researching oh is it okay to weightlift at 14 and they would like literally say oh no you shouldn't because it's going to stunt your growth but it's wrong do your own research. It's literally proven by science that having muscle around your bones helps them elongate to grow. And if you don't know, like, yeah, growing is like literally the like elongation of your bones. But anyway, so having muscle around your bones is proven to help you grow. And every anyone who's tall can back me up. You think that they don't do like sports or weightlifting. Uh, so literally doing physical activity and building your muscle. And if you're still skeptical of going to the gym, any sports, if you do it consistently and regularly while eating this high calorie high protein high carbs diet i can promise you that you'll grow for me i've been going to the gym for the past year and i also regularly play sports and i used to do swimming a lot and also cardio such as badminton because i find running quite boring so doing these physical activities i promise you will help you grow and don't believe all these people saying that it will stun your growth and the third one is sleep. And so sleep is extremely important for your growth because even if you're eating well and you're doing all this physical activity, if you're not sleeping, if you're not allowing the growth, because if you didn't know, growth is growth happens while you're sleeping. So if you're literally doing all the right things, but you're not allowing your results to actually come, 
it's like studying for a test but you're never actually doing the test you have to sleep and the advice of getting eight hours is good and all but how many times have you tried to go to bed for eight hours but then you have some schoolwork or something comes up so you end up only being able to sleep for like six hours so you should be aiming more for like nine ten hours and although this sounds unreasonable just trying to focus on your sleep quality and trying to sleep more will really Im improve your height and if you struggle to fall asleep i like just not doing social media before sleeping and just like reading a book or meditating beforehand can help you sleep quicker so to summarize fix your mentality drop all these beliefs that are harmful for you and believe that you can get tall that you shouldn't believe in this all black pill or if you if you aren't born with the right chromosome you're not going to get tall and secondly bulk and cut out processed foods and then also do some sort of physical activity and then also get a lot of sleep and i promise you that that's how i grew and i think that when you look at the comments people are going to be saying like this really works for them as well and giving you tips